On this day, 32 years ago, on December 21st, 1988, local time, a bomb destroyed Pan Am Flight 103 as it flew 31,000 feet over Lockerbie, Scotland. The massive Boeing 747, known as the Clipper Maiden of the Seas, exploded and fell to the ground in countless pieces, scattered across 840 square miles, nearly the entire width of Scotland. The explosion killed all 259 people on board, 243 passengers and 16 crew members, including 190 Americans. I am pleased to announce that the United States has filed criminal charges against the third conspirator, Abu Aguila Masood Kir al Marimi, for his role in the bombing of Pan Am Flight 103. Let there be no mistake, no amount of time or distance will stop the United States and our Scottish partners from pursuing justice in this case. The breakthrough that led to the charges announced today arose when law enforcement learned in 2016 that the third conspirator had been arrested after the collapse of the Gaddafi regime and had been interviewed by Libyan law enforcement. The interview occurred in September of 2012. According to the criminal complaint affidavit, Masood built the bomb that destroyed Pan Am 103. To the families of those who died in the sky over Lockerbie all those years ago, I know that the small step we take today cannot compensate for the sorrow you feel to this day. But I hope that you will find some measure of solace in knowing that we in the United States government, on behalf of the American people and in partnership with our counterparts in Scotland, have never relented and will never relent in the pursuit of justice for you and for your loved ones.